Welcome to another bite-sized training tape for football officials. We're going to have a, a look at, at something we don't see very often. It's rule 9117, continued participation without a helmet. We're going to be looking at the, um, the third defensive lineman from the camera. So the guy just beyond the ball. And he's going to start out here and... There, he's going to lose his helmet. Now, right now, he's okay because he stopped participating. Whether or not it's a foul, we don't know uh, the, the reason he lost his helmet. But now that he has lost his helmet, the rule says that you have to, uh, you cannot continue to participate beyond the immediate action in which he was engaged. So that was while he was on the ground. Now he gets up and the quarterback starts to run. Now he's fouled because now he continues. Um, he doesn't have to make contact. This is a personal foul without any contact. So he doesn't have to make any contact with anybody. Just the fact that he starts running here is a foul. And here come the flags. Very well done by the wing and, and the umpire to be on top of it. So um, he gets up. He's fine. But now he fouled. And this is a this is a foul, and and even though he never makes any contact, this is a personal foul by this defender. And uh, if there's no foul in him losing his helmet, he also has to come out for one play, um, unless of course they take a timeout. But this obviously is a personal foul uh, by the defense, so it's. Um, uh, 15 yards tagged on to the end of the play and no you cannot pick up the flag and give it to the official so that was it for this edition of the bite-sized training tape so as always thank you for watching